It's time for your phone tap. And recently, a woman reached out to us saying her and her husband are having a disagreement because mm. she's pregnant and wants to know the gender of their baby during the next ultrasound. Oh, okay. this is a big deal. Yeah, it's a big, big thing. Yeah, he's a little more old fashioned and doesn't want to know. Okay. So, uh, and Brooke, you never found out until the baby was born, right? Yeah, that's right. Wow. But well, each to each their own. Well, sure. we're going to call from the doctor's office and tell him it's 100% cool that he wants to keep it a surprise. Okay. No, but Jeff. other people in the office need to know that information. Oh, <laughs> wait, what? And there's a very good reason for it. You're going to hear oh. in your phone tap right now. <laughs> Hello? Hi, is this Derek? Uh, yep, yeah, yeah, speaking. Who's calling? Hey, Derek, my name's Todd from North Women's Healthcare. You and your wife are coming in tomorrow for another ultrasound on your baby here? Uh, yeah, tomorrow, right. I think uh, 1 o'clock, yeah. Right, perfect. Um, so do you, do you guys want to know the gender during your appointment? Because uh, we've had a situation where the past text said it and the couple didn't want to know. <laughs> yeah, definitely, definitely no. Okay, you said yeah? Definitely, you like yeah. you do want to know. No, no, I definitely do not want to know. Oh, I want to make that very clear. I okay. definitely do not want to. Know. Okay, sorry, you were you were saying yeah, definitely no, like you know what I mean. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, but I was agreeing with the no. I was agreeing with telling you I don't want to know. So let there be no confusion. I want it to be a surprise. All right, you want to you want to keep it a secret. Yes. Okay, got it. Um, let me mark that down. Okay, boring guy. <laughs> what? All right, and uh, so legally, I need to ask you: Is it okay if the tech and office staff bet on the gender of your baby? Did, did you say did you say you wanted to bet on the gender of the baby? The tech and office staff. If we bet, do we have your permission? Um, I, that sounds kind of weird. I don't know. I really, to be honest with you, I really don't want you betting on the gender of my well, baby. Well, it's just, it gets kind of boring around here, you know? We like to keep things interesting when we can. We just have to alert you that we're doing that ahead of time, you know, so for litigation I, I, reasons. But uh, I'm alerting you that I don't think that's proper. You wouldn't know about it. Like, maybe you would hear cheers coming from the other side of the door when the tech tells us, but that's just a way for what? the staff to have fun. And no, just... no, no, no. This is like starting to... Like, I don't get angry very easily, but this is starting to raise my level here. No, I, I'm sorry. I don't, I don't mean to anger you. I'm just saying. You yeah, know, but you are. Well, we try and bet on things just to raise the excitement level a little bit after they banned us from betting on if patients had herpes or not. Oh. So this is all we have You bet on a patient at herpes? That's yeah. what you do when they come in. You bet. No, well, I don't no, want you know, anybody betting I, I don't, on. You don't understand, no. sir. It, it's like when someone new would walk in through the door. We used to be like, oh, okay, I'll give you three to one odds if they have herpes or not. So that was kind of exciting until they put the kibosh on that. Yeah, I would imagine they would. What is wrong with you people? I don't want you betting on, on if we have an illness, anything, let alone our genders. No, no, they banned that. So we're not, we can't do that anymore. We're only allowed to bet on baby genders now. This is really upsetting to me. I need you guys to stop. Okay, trust you know me. I was upset too when they told us that it was banned. There is something seriously wrong with you. You know how many times I covered on triple her parlays? <laughs> parlays for her? You had three <laughs> different people walking in the door, and I called all three correctly. Oh, oh, my God. Everybody talks about it to this day, what Todd did. Listen, this is not Vegas, okay? This is my child. I don't want you guys screwing it up. And it sounds like that's what you're going to do. So get me a supervisor now. Wait, well, I'm, why do you want a supervisor? Because this is not appropriate I, it's too late in the game for us to change our, our health care, but if this is what I have to do, this is what I have to do. Are you, are you going to tell him about the herpes thing? Because he's still mad that we even did that. <laughs> yeah, I might bring it up to oh, solidify God. my case. No, please don't. Well, you shouldn't have bet on a guy's herpes. You shouldn't have done that. Okay, this call isn't going the way I thought it was going to go. Um... Me neither. Me neither. Seriously, if I don't speak to a supervisor, I need to start looking for new doctors, and I need to do it right now. Okay. Well, I don't know of any other doctors that do this. I guess, I mean, I guess we can ask over the radio. Um, hey, does anybody know any doctors besides this one? What? Anybody listening know? What are you talking about? Yeah, I'm asking our listeners on the radio right now because you're on Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning, and this is a prank call. You gotta be kidding me. Yeah, man, this is a phone tab. <laughs> My name is Jeff, dude. <laughs> 
Oh, my God. Do you have any idea how I, I just broke a pen? I'm at work. I just broke a pen. I'm sorry. <laughs> Your wife, Lacey, is the one who set you up for it. She said that you guys had a disagreement oh. about whether or not to find out the gender of your baby. And she thought we could mess oh, with yeah. you. Yeah, that is hysterical. Oh, so wait, do you want to know the gender or does she want to know? She wants to know. I want to be a surprise. I don't want to know. That's why I got so crazy oh. when you were saying it. And then you started to hurt me singing. I'm like, what kind of sick people are you? <laughs> but you can tell, just give me a yes or no on if you have the hurt and I might win $500. <laughs> no, no, no. I don't have the <laughs> Just lost me 500 bucks, bro. What the hell? <laughs>